jobs. This is my job. This is what I get to do for a living. Pretty cool. A very male-dominated business, as you have seen. So being a chick is quite rare. And obviously, with my height, you know, I bring something new to the table. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to talk about this shit because it's comedy gold. <laughs> yeah. And you're going to notice I do call myself a midget. A lot of people don't realize the term midget is actually considered quite offensive. Yes, a bad word amongst the little people community. <laughs> Plus, little people do prefer the term little person or dwarf. Like I said, I don't give a shit. You know, it's just a word. <laughs> Uh, I understand in which context it's being used, and I know generally it's not meant to be offensive. I understand that most people assume I'm a midget, right? But you also assume I gotta have midget friends. Oh, like there's packs of us hanging around together. Uh, scooter gangs and midgets just terrorizing the city. Woo! Power to the pygmies. Actually, one of the coolest times I ever had was with another little person because one night we got all drunk on cough syrup. <laughs> we'd go down to the town park, we'd hang out amongst the flowers and pretend we're garden gnomes. <laughs> Freak out old people, boo! <laughs> Laugh and dance and play our little flutes. <laughs> You gotta be a people person to this job. I like people, you know, and I get people are curious about my life. That's why I talk about all the crazy antics that I get into, you know, and I don't mind the questions. If you wanna come chat later, feel free. You know, probably the most common question I get asked is if I have any children. You know, very valid. People wonder if I can physically carry any kids, and I don't have any kids, but I could. You know, I just don't want the little bastards. <laughs> <laughs> Tight, tight as a drum. <laughs> I'm just saying, I know, because I fucked a Scottish guy and he called me a wee cunt. <laughs> Fun job. I get to work with great people too every night. It's a new, you know, new group of guys typically. You know, I've worked with Lawrence before, Lawrence Clark, the guy in the wheelchairs. A good mate of mine, actually. We've uh, we are part of a, a group called Abnormally Funny People. So I do shows with them. We did uh, Edinburgh, we had our 10 year sort of a anniversary show in 2015. So we did a whole month in Edinburgh, and I had to live in the same flat as Lawrence. And uh, you may have noticed that Lawrence has a lot of involuntary, you know, movements and shit like that. And uh, get punched in the head a lot when you're fucking <laughs> yeah. I did learn something though never take Lawrence to a fucking auction <laughs> fuck, it was already a furnished flat but fuck there was a lot more when we left let me tell you <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.